I'll tell you this, you're no pushover, that's for sure. If you weren't rotten to the core, you'd actually make a perfect sparring partner for me. What a waste of talent. That's just the sort of small-minded dribble that makes your existence so intolerable. Go on, channel that Super Saiyan glow I hate so much. To be honest, Frieza, I'm not so sure I need to yet. Well, well, well. Our monkey's wearing even bigger britches now. That's right. Bye. The black-haired Goku's belt will look just as good on my wall. How's that possible? Freeze is more monstrous than ever, but Goku hasn't taken a single blow. I feel like I'm stuck in some kind of bizarro nightmare. How can one Earthling have that much strength? Well, he grew up here, but he is a Saiyan, you know. You're obviously joking. The Saiyans were a brutal warrior race driven to extinction. There can't be one here. It's true. Actually, my husband's a Saiyan, too. Two Saiyans? Oh, come on! I'll pretend I didn't hear that. It was my job to keep this world Saiyan free. That would be way too much paperwork. Seriously? That's all you've got? on me, Vegeta, but stay out of this fight. I want to crush Goku myself. There, you see? Let me fight him just a little longer and then we can switch off. Well, this is unexpected. I knew a great deal of time had passed since our battle, and I knew you were the self-improvement type, but you've climbed higher than I thought. I tried to warn you, Frieza. It's fortunate I trained so hard, or I might actually be scared. I knew it. You've been holding something back, haven't you? That's well deduced for a simpleton. I've held back just like you. Then let's both go all in. No more tricks, no reserves. Very well, monkeys first. Sure about that? I don't want you to get discouraged. It's a little more complicated than that. You don't have the patience for the full story. So let's say I got a taste of something called Super Saiyan God, and now I've learned to tap into that power on my own. Not bad at all, Goku. This is just further vindication. If I hadn't evolved to a new level myself, then this might have proven rather perilous for me. I think it's time you stop talking and start showing me, Frieza. <laughs> I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. 
And for the sake of your feeble mind, let's keep the name simple as well. We'll call this Golden Freezer. Of course, I hope you've realized this iteration has far more to it than a shimmering new facade. I noticed. To be honest, you're more powerful than I was expecting as well, Frieza, and it's definitely got my heart beating a few ticks faster. This is going to be quite the epic battle, my old nemesis. Sure as hell won't be an easy. Hey, Vegeta! So you want to take that turn right now, or what? Pawn him off on me now, Kakarot! He told us he wanted to fight you, remember? <laughs> okay, let's give this a shot. You sure you want to keep going? You're better off leaving on a high note while you still can. You just got a new life, and I'd hate for you to waste it. You can't think I'd retreat with victory so close at hand. What sort of fool do you think I am? Kakarot, take my turn now if you want. Oh, come on! That's not fair! The only reason you're volunteering now is because you see his weakness too! See my weakness? <laughs> this is truly becoming a farce. I heard you two click sight and you want to talk about my weakness? Fine, I'll play along. What is my fatal shortcoming? <laughs> it's not affecting you yet, Frieza, but it's about to. You're too eager for revenge, that's why you failed. Let me take a wild guess about your training. You bolted to Earth the moment you achieved this new golden form of yours, didn't you? And so what if I did? What's your point? Your new form is burning through more power than your body can supply. You should have waited until you were used to this form and knew how to regulate it before you started picking fights. Is that what you cling to? Well, in that case, I'll just stop wasting my time and kill you right now! I told you you'd run out of gas. Now take my advice and get out of here. And live to fight another day. I'll be here for a rematch when you're ready, I promise. Damn you! This shouldn't be happening! I am not Frieza! Good thing for contingency plans, right, Goku? As if I'd allow even the slightest chance of losing to you again. You know, I did try to warn Goku this might happen. Now you're the one on the ground, facing defeat. You won the battle, but you lost the war. Die! Oh, there's an interesting thought. We could make this moment so much more delectable. Oh, Vegeta, come down here for a second. Wouldn't you like to do it? I know you despise this Saiyan underling for daring to be so uppity. Thanks for the offer, but I can't. As annoying as this bastard can be, it's our rivalry that keeps pushing me to get stronger. I can't afford to kill him. <laughs> what if I sweeten the deal? 
Take Goku's life, and I'll appoint you the Supreme Commander of the entire Frieza Force. You would make me your Supreme Commander. Is that a real offer? Should I take that as a yes? Damn Now I may actually regret this. But I've already made my decision. I'm going to pulverize you until there's nothing left. You dare say that to me? Use your head. Do you actually think I would stay loyal to you after you blew up the planet I was destined to rule? That's right. You had no idea, did you? I've been a Super Saiyan for years, and now I too have the power of a god. You of all people should know this about me, but I don't share Kakarot's taste for forgiveness. I'm sending you back to hell. Ah, ah. Your threats are as empty as your title. All hail Vegeta, Prince of No One. Real. This is not the way this ends! At least try to face your death with some honor. And don't dream of resurrecting again. You can all go to hell without me! I can turn back time, remember? But you'll have to move quickly. Three minutes is as far back as I'm able to manage. No, this can't be real. This is not the way this ends! At least try to face your death with some honor. And don't dream of resurrecting again. You can all go to hell without me! You showing your cards tells me that you're young. <laughs> well, I appreciate the compliment because I'm actually a grandfather. That's young to a man who's a thousand years old. A thousand years old? Oh, for real? You really are my senior and then some. Here, let's start this over. I look forward to our fight, sir. Now it's time to fight. I definitely didn't see that one coming. You're... <laughs> well, well, how about that? I just beat your time skipping attack. I did it! I just hit you in the face! Lucky shot. Maybe, maybe not. So, let's see if you're right. That was amazing! How did Goku do that? Over here. And my speed's gonna make it even more of a challenge. Gotta give Hit credit. He 
hanging in there against Goku, even though he's in his Super Saiyan Blue form. What's the matter? Aren't you gonna use that time skip? I'll admit it. Without that technique, I won't last long. Okay, so what are you waiting for? Try it out now. Very well. Yes, it seems Goku has found its flaw. Now they see what my Saiyan can do. Your Saiyan? Here I thought I was the one training you. Of course, it's easier to go second. He used my fight to study Hit's moves. to know why he screamed. That's it, Goku! You've got him up against the ropes! Interesting. I wasn't sure that would work. Perhaps he wanted to start his attack with some showmanship, like Goku does. I can't increase my ability through some kind of noisy transformation the way Frost and Saiyans do. If I want to become more lethal, I don't have the luxury of cutting corners. I just have to do it the old-fashioned way. He's talking about his pure technique. Somehow he's figured out how to improve his fighting move in the middle of this match without any boost to his power. Combat is craft. What matters most is not raw power, but the skill by which you hone it. I never even thought of improving my time skill. Up to now, there was no reason, since I could defeat anyone. Based on the results of my last... You're badly misreading the situation you're in, Goku. Right now, you're trying to calculate how many of my blows you'll be able to absorb while you try to predict my attacks. You believe two-tenths of a second won't make enough difference and you'll still be able to take the damage and make a counter-strike, but that's where you're wrong. I'm not done improving yet. My time skip is unfeeling. That time I skipped forward half a second, which is five times. I pulled it off. All the power of Super Saiyan Blue intensified with the Kaioken technique. If I'd messed this up even a little, my energy would have run out of control, and with this much of it, I would have been toast. His energy keeps shooting higher. It's extraordinary.
even with the energy control of Blue, I can't keep this up for long. A worthy rival. That's what inspires evolution in the warrior's talents. Right in that moment, I increased my time skip even farther. That's how I dodged your attack. And I'm going to keep on him. The Sixth Universe's team has been amazing. I'd say they were all pretty tough opponents. I'm just glad I finally got the chance to fight the best of them all.